G'day, I'm just going to quickly demonstrate another monitor ROM upgrade for the Ohio Superboard. This is my a revision B, and what I've done, I've downloaded the uh, monitor ROM, and I'm using the DA Bug Free, created by David Anir in 1980, and I haven't cut any tracks, I've just... Uh, bent uh, pin 21, pin 20, and pin 18 on my EEPROM, and just put some jumpers to the appropriate signal for pin 18, and 5 volts on the right enable, and the uh, chip enable to ground. Okay, let's just power this up. Okay, we're going to hit break. So far, it appears fairly standard. We're going to enter into basic. Okay, and what I'm going to do, I'm just going to load a simple little program just a few lines ago to demonstrate some of the features of this uh, version of the monitor and how it interacts with basic. So we're just going to do a load and then I'm just going to paste in some code uh, using putty. And this is at 300 board and we're using the serial port on the machine and there we go we've loaded how sample whole piece of code we we'll just press space so we're now going to load so I'll run at full speed I'm just going to run this little sample piece of code that runs really nicely but let's demonstrate one of the really nice features of this upgrade which is the ability to edit your code using a line editor Okay, so first thing I'm going to do is enable the enhancement by going Control Q, and you'll notice under the OK, uh, an indicator has appeared to show that we've actually loaded the enhancements. And now what I'd like to do is just modify uh, line 50. So I'm going to go Control U to move up. And now I'm going to use Control A and you'll see that the line I want to edit is being produced down at the bottom of the screen. And what I'm going to do, we're just going to add to the code. I'm just going to now go, I'm just going to type a space and and you'll see that we've actually edited the code. The other thing you'll also see that I'm doing a print chart 27 to clear the screen. Okay, let's just run this and I have successfully edited the code. Also, if I hit rub out, it clears the entire screen. Okay, now if I list and if I had made an error, okay, I can simply go shift O as it could be for, but now you'll see that it's giving us a true um, rub out or backspace. Okay, so there we go. Um, there's also some really other interesting enhancements, and that's the ability uh, to use um, some keywords. So, um, say I wanted to use load again, we can just go escape and that indicator appears to show that's in keyword mode. Hit load, which is just a simple L. Press enter, and we've used a keyword. And, okay, I'm just sending that same piece of code back over the serial port. And there's quite a comprehensive list of keywords. And I'll leave a link to where you can find a copy of the bindery and uh, the assembler and some documentation. And there's just some of the keywords and some of the operations. Also, if you have a Model B, it has the ability to toggle between uh, the 48, uh, 16 graphics or text mode. Okay. This is a really interesting little ROM, and I hope you enjoyed 
this quick little video just showing some of the features that this uh, monitor includes which really does enhance the way that basic functions especially the screen editor which is very useful okay cheers thanks for watching and we'll catch you next time